Great. I told you to leave it alone, Ethan. You are in the way. What do you care, Chris? You killed my wife, you son of a bitch! You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. What? What? She's a bioweapon. She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. Oh my god. She also survived being shot, so now I'm here to finish the job. Bullshit! Why don't you fucking tell me right away? Because I knew you would want to be involved. And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Huh. Why us, Chris? What the hell is going on? All right, Ethan. All right. I guess I owe you an explanation. Hmm. Hand me that wrench. Long story short, Miranda's fucking insane. In this mm. village, all these monsters and freaks, this is her life's work. Some sort of crazy experiment with the mold. The mold. Like Louisiana. God damn it. All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything. Take a look at this. My men sent those pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda. Keep looking. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go! Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. You don't get it, Ethan. Hmm. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. <clears throat> Stay down here and finish planting explosives. You take that elevator. I'll meet you topside. I promise you, we will get your daughter back. Together. Damn straight, we will. And when I find Miranda, she's a dead woman. All right, Ethan. Then you take this and do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. I thought he handed him the wrench. The wrench is still there. Hold. Okay, so we'll do that in a sec. I just want to look around first. Examine. Two. Hound Wolf Squad. The sweep of the factory is complete. No proof of any connection with the organization. Guess this just wasn't our lucky day. I did manage to get my hands on a number of documents disclosing some of Miranda's experiments which support our previous theories. She seems to have infected her herself with the muta mutamycete which has granted her a number of abilities, including mimicry. She can control her cells and transform herself to look like anyone or anything. She disguised herself as Mia and infiltrated the Winters' home. Her objective was clearly to kidnap Rose. Maybe she thought she could control Rose easier if she looked like her mom. When we attacked, it put a little damper on her plans, so she mimicked a corpse. She then revived herself in the transport truck, killed everyone on board, and took off with Rose. Things didn't go the way she had originally planned, but in the end, she still got what she wanted. Until now. It's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found something useful. He left one of his little toys laying around, and it's even made from a metal polymer composite, which he can't control. Time to turn the tables. Alpha. Save. Alright, so we've got a tank. Excellent. What did I say? I hope they give us like some kind of turret thing that has unlimited ammo where we can just shoot a lot. And well, there it is. First aid. Excellent. Okay. So I guess we'll take 
take this. Actually, hold on, are we able to just ride the elevator at this point? No. Okay. So where did Chris go? He just disappeared. I guess so. Alright, well I read all your classified files, Chris. <laughs> wrench is still that bugs me he said hand me the wrench he handed in the wrench and then the wrench is still there all right anyway what are we doing okay metal polymer composite huh time to fight fire with fire yeah <clears throat> Infinite ammo. Hey, thanks, Proud Roach, for the 17 Man months. Running. Man running. <laughs> Old ready cannon, fire cannon. What am I even supposed to do here? Right. Just... Flesh and blood. 
I don't know where I'm supposed to be shooting. Says, use your knife. <laughs> Crystal Heisenberg. All right. Okay. Whew. Alpha. Ethan, I heard explosions. What the hell happened? Mm -hmm. I dealt with Heisenberg. Now I'm gonna find Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. <clears throat> it's too dangerous. Wait there. You hear me? I don't know how I survived Ethan. that. Ethan, respond. No, no, no. Ethan, don't be stupid. Mia? Oh my god. Our child. Ethan, you read everything. So Chris told you. She? Don't be stupid. She's everything to me. <laughs> and mine to me. With Heisenberg on, you've lost your lead. What are you going to do? I don't know, but I'm saving Rose. You'd never know, do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that'll work. Enough. Remember Evelyn and her power over the mall? Rose is her successor. No. Rose is Evelyn's true, complete form. She will grow to fully control the masses. And I must have it. Fuck you, you crazy bitch! Oh, yeah. Calm yourself. <laughs> Rose will be saved. The Mega My Seat catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. She's my child, not yours. Where are you? Show yourself! Why did Rose come to be? Was it because of her parents? Mm. And you are truly a special case. But I've learned all I can from you. 
Your worth as a lab rat has run out. Miranda! You coward! Come on and face me! Oh. Don't worry. Your death will come quick. You will join the Mega My Seeds records. Well, I will shit. make sure to sample your blood for later. Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete, and I will become her true mother, bound for eternity in blood. <laughs> well, shit. The end. I've waited so long. <laughs> but dreams really can come true. Vessel or not, I can't wait. To see my true child again. Six wings. Wow. Well then. Are we dead now? <laughs> Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. Is that the end? My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. Who knew she could fake being a corpse? <laughs> Since Miranda could have infected <clears throat> Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. And she is not gonna get away with it. God damn it, when does it end? What's that, sir? The mission? Hmm. Yeah. All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. It'll end Three when the franchise stops making money. <laughs> but if they keep knocking it out of the park with amazing entries like these. Shit. SA got here already. They didn't waste any time. Mission adjustment? No, doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Okay. K9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. Roger that. I'm on it. Since we fought together, Captain. Huh. When was the last? The desert? Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. But thanks to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard she turned herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at either. Spooky. Well, damn, this is a bit of a left turn, isn't it?
at that. Crazy. Alright, well, not sure where we're going. Made contact with a group of hostile bioweapons. There's more than we thought. Watch out. like your reward for all the crap you put through and put through lack of ammo lack of firepower just let chris take over go in and kick a bunch of ass <laughs> things hold. It's amazing. I love it. Taking down those big werewolf things like nothing. Hey boss, it's me. I'm at the location preparing for support fire. I mean, Roger. Tundra here. Leaving some supplies in one of the houses, Captain. Help yourself. Oh, night vision. I love it. Seven hundred fourteen bullets. <laughs> oh, I recognize this area. Yeah, okay, good. in this. So we can just go through the village and just kind of wreck house, basically. Ha <laughs> ha. 
like reload a little faster seriously Oh my god, why are they still... Fuck sake. Ugh. The weapons are not placed where I normally like to have them. Hi there. Swarm of them. Marking the target. Yeah. Roger that, boss. Where am I? Am I marking that? I guess that's it. Okay. Good. Reloading now. Just a minute. It's a small pity that we. these years, please. Oh, 
trying. Fuck sake. They're just like, I can't reload. Like, every time they attack me, it interrupts the reload, and it has to restart. <sighs> Fucking ridiculous, man. Damn, this is big. All right, Lobo. Marking the target. Roger that, boss. All right. Reloading now. Just a minute. This is small minute that we I'm on my way. Let's see if there's any more supplies kicking around somewhere that I could grab. Maybe. Yeah. Church. Kitty just walked by. Excellent. Whew. That was that was hairy. I found a way down. I'm going in. The rest of you stay back. Captain, <clears throat> I compared the mold at the village with a sample from the baker's hand. Uh, there's no sign of the genome editing we saw in the E series. The stuff originated here. Chris, want to put on your night vision or what?
Lobo. I got a tough guy here. I'm gonna need backup. Boss, you're on the ground. There's an opening in the roof. Use it. Okay, I'm moving out. Hold on till I get there. Fucking get up, please. Keep going. Can't believe Rest I missed. You, stay above ground. Missed that one shot. <sighs> he moved like at the last second. Alright, so where are we? Where are we going? What are we doing? We're going in here? Okay. <laughs> exists. A moldy little bird told her, maybe? We can figure that out later. Focus on the plan. I found it. It's the Megamycete. For the squad, I've located the Megamycete. So now we can end this mess after all. About damn time. <clears throat> uh. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. I have eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give the order. I know it's too late now, but we really should have told Ethan the plan. There wasn't time. We didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even so, you should have told him. Mm. Yeah. Well, you know, hindsight being 2020 and all that. Just like all ammo. What is this? Combat knife. That's great for close combat. Alright, well let's uh let's put that in there. Yeah. 
Yeah, it would have been nice to know I had that before. I guess I should have checked my inventory when we started. This must be Miranda's lab. So they're using this to control the bioweapons. Dear Miranda, my deepest apologies for not meeting you in person. I would love nothing more than to visit your quaint village once more. However, I am incredi incredibly busy. Then again, I suppose for an immortal woman such as yourself, you no longer remember this poor half-dead medical student in the snow. I've always cherished the revelations I came to 15 years ago when I stayed in your village. I was inspired by your research. To think one could transform a human by infecting them with an organism. Positively visionary. I knew that with that knowledge, I could achieve my own vision for the next step in human evolution. Even after two world wars and humanity on the cusp of another, my conviction never wavered. I realized, however, through the many nights of intellectual talks you and I shared, that your conviction differed from mine. You hoped to bring back a single dead person while I aimed to change the world. Your experiments on the mold would not have aided me in my endeavor to achieve an exponential infection. I thought a virus would be more effective. This is why, my dear, I had to leave you. I still regret never telling you goodbye. My apologies for reminiscing. I actually have news that I thought might please you. I have found the key to evolution, the progenitor, a virus found in Africa. I plan to start a company with friends and colleagues dedicated to the virus's research. I will call it Umbrella. Just like the symbol in the cave that we spoke about, I'm one step closer to making my vision a reality. I hope you'll be able to achieve your goal, your goal someday, too. You taught me so much, and for that, I will be forever in your debt. Sincerely, your lifelong student, Oswell E. Spencer. Well, shit. Origin of Umbrella. Spencer, <clears throat> here. No way. My Eva, it's been 100 years since I lost you to the Spanish flu. I was so powerless back then. But now I can, but now, now I can bring you back to life in the Megamycete. I had had to test your new vessel's regenerative abilities. I took her apart and revived her in the Megamycete regulator, the giant's chalice. All that is left is to merge her with the Megamycete. The ceremony can finally begin. After I lost you, I was so stricken with grief that I wandered into a cave to die. I so wanted to be with you again. And that's when I found it, the Megamycete, completely by accident. When I touched the black substance, my mind was overcome with knowledge. The Megamycete breaks down and absorbs the consciousness of those who have perished. I knew that if your consciousness was in there too, then there would be a way to bring you back. I just needed the right vessel. When I returned to the village, I implanted the villagers with mold from the Megamycete. That way I could control them, experiment on them. I've experimented on hundreds of people just to find you the perfect vessel. I even tried to increase the efficiency of finding a vessel by creating a parasite I call Kadu, yet none of my experiments come to fr came to fruition. There were some, like Alcina, who were close to being perfect, but most were turned into lichens. I was once approached by an organization who said they would assist me. I gave them some of the mold and your DNA. But all they created was another defect, Evelyn. Then again, not a complete failure. I learned of Rose thanks to them, and I knew she would be the perfect vessel. There was some interference, but I was able to verify her suitability. 
Now my research is finally complete. Eva, I waited too long to see you again. Rotten says it's always a virus and evolution and Africa with Resident Evil. Yes, quite. Okay then. Well. Subject, Alcina Dimitrescu, Cadu Affinity most favorable, brain functions normal. Regeneration rate is incredibly fast. The subject can heal any external wound within seconds and grow her nails into claws in mere moments. Rapid regeneration also means an increased body size. Note, due to a hereditary blood disease, the subject must ingest human flesh and blood on a regular basis to maintain regeneration properties. I suspect that if the subject's regeneration is not properly balanced, then she may mutate uncontrollably, an unfit vessel for Eva. <coughs> subject name, Salvatore Moreau, Cadu affin Affinity Low, Brain Functions Surprisingly Low. The Cadu has caused drastic changes to internal organs, transforming them into organs similar to fish-like gills and a swim bladder, another subject with irregular cell division causing him to transform into a giant fish. The subject is unable to control this transformation. Too many defects, an unfit vessel for Eva. Hmm. Is there more of those? Oh, here we are. Heisenberg. Subject name, Carl Heisenberg. Cadu affinity, incredibly favorable. Brain functions, normal. Has electric organs, similar to the electric ray. Narc japonica. Uh, these electric organs are connected to the subject's nervous system. Can therefore pass and control electricity throughout the entire body, allowing control of magnetic fields, which is used to move metal. Splendid specimen, but still an unfit vessel for Eva. Finally, Donna Beneviento. Cadu affinity, favorable. Brain functions, normal, although severe mental illness. Physically, she is no different from a regular human. However, she can secrete a signal producing substance which controls plants infected by the mitomycete. When humans absorb the pollen from a particular flower, she can cause them to have hallucinations. However, she is mentally underdeveloped and has divided her cadu among her dolls in order to control them from a distance. An unfit vessel for Eva. Okay. Well, that, that covers all of them. we came in. That's where we came in. So there's got to be another exit here. Generally, we go through. Ah, here we are. Show me your hands. 
Um, Bryce, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right now? Still at the ceremony site. Whatever she's doing, she's staying put. Uh huh. God damn. It really is you. Actually, Mia. I'm glad you saved Mia. Why are you here? I was caught. In Houston experiments. Wait, did you say Mia? Mia Winters? In the flesh. What's the situation up there? Kind of a war going on. Nothing we can't handle. Don't get distracted. <coughs> Stick to the mission. I'm headed to the ceremony site. Wait. You can't leave me here. You promised, damn it! You said that you would keep us safe. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything! And I didn't care. So long as we were together. So you tell me, where is my husband? Where is my daughter? Ethan is... gone. I couldn't save him. But I can save Rose. Come on. It's not safe here after all. What do you mean he's gone? He's dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No! You're wrong. I tried to keep this a secret, but... You don't understand how special he is. 